Catherine, Princess of Wales is all smiles as Prince William takes part in one of the oldest royal traditions, the Order of the Garter Service. Catherine supported her husband on Monday as he made his debut as the Prince of Wales at the Order of the Garter Ceremony and Procession at Windsor Castle. Kate watched as Prince William, King Charles, Queen Camilla and other members of the royal family donned ornate blue robes and hats featuring an ostrich plume at the prestigious event dating back centuries. Princess Kate exchanged a grin with Prince William as he processed past her. And when King Charles and Queen Camilla walked by, she dipped into a curtsy. In addition to the ceremony having historic roots, it is also a milestone in Prince William and Princess Kate's relationship. Kate made her debut at the event in 2008 as William's girlfriend when he received his Order of the Garter knighthood. Wearing an elegant black and white outfit, Kate was spotted chatting with Prince Harry and Camilla. Kate's attendance was significant, showing that she was being welcomed into the royal family fold. The now Prince and Princess of Wales met as students at the University of St Andrews in Scotland. Three years after Kate's outing at the Order of the Garter service, the pair married at Westminster Abbey. Over the past 15 years, Kate has attended the Order of the Garter ceremony with the royal family on many occasions. For this year's service, the Princess of Wales wore a long-sleeved dress by Alessandra Rich paired with a coordinating hat by Philip Tracy. The look was strikingly similarly to her 2008 look at the debut. Her hair was swept into an elegant updo. Kate accessorized with the Collingwood pearl and diamond earrings that previously belonged to her late mother-in-law, Princess Diana. The jewels were a key part of Diana's jewelry box, and Princess Kate has worn them on numerous occasions, sometimes pairing them with a tiara for glamorous palace events. She stood with Sophie, the Duchess of Edinburgh, who sported a sleeveless dress by Amelia Wickstead decorated in a pink and green floral pattern topped with a Jane Taylor hat.